Hello guys, welcome to another tutorial from the Nice Tower channel. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to create this coffee shop model. Before that, if you enjoy this kind of tutorial, please subscribe to our YouTube channel if you haven't already, so you don't miss our upcoming tutorial. And don't forget to like, comment and share the video with your friends. So let's jump in. At first, let me import an AutoCAD file go to file menu and click on import and choose AutoCAD file so now as you can see we have a tool plan first let me draw a rectangle and take it and offset up to here and delete this face so and now by push pull tools extrude it by 300 centimeters and empty this face so now let me scale here by 1.4 here too a skill one point four okay and now select all and make it group then by rectangle tools draw another rectangle here too so extrude it up to here 600 centimeter here 470 centimeter and then select all and make it group now let me move the 2d map up to here and now let me create the openings for the windows and door my tape measure draw some guidelines like this here here too and another guideline by 50 centimeter again by 90 centimeter then by using rectangle tools draw rectangle here then by using arc tools draw an arcs like this so let me erase this line and then select this face and take a copy here here too and now empty here here too then select this face and take a copy up to here so now empty here here too let's draw a rectangle for door by 90 centimeter comma 200 centimeter empty here too now delete the guidelines let me create another face here like this so now first select the face then by using 1001 bit tools plugin and create a window 
So, as you can see now, we have a window. Let me move it here. And then, put it a color here and a glass color for here then create another face and take an offset outside of the window delete this face and extrude it by 5 cm then select all and make it blue. Yeah. Then select both of them and make component. Now let me move it a little bit here. And then let me put it a color. Take a copy up to here. Again. Here. And here too, rotate, and by flip tool, take a copy here. Now let me create a door here by using 1001 bit tools plugin. Put it a color here and put a glass color here so now let me draw a rectangle here and extrude it by 20 centimeter here by 30 centimeter here and now let's put a roof color here. And now select all and make it group. So let me move the 2D plan here, then Draw a rectangle here, take an offset and move this line up to here. So now to let this face and extrude up to here. Now let me change something here, draw a line and Erase this section and draw another line and move it up to here. So now select this line and take a copy by 20 centimeter. Let me fix it. Then extrude it up to here. And now extrude this face let me hide this one and select this face and escalate up to here so delete this guideline and unhide the last shape draw another rectangle Extrude it by 20 centimeter here too and here and move this edge up to here like this and let me put it a color here here and a roof color here now select all and make it grow. Then by using flip tool, take a copy 
from this then draw a guideline here here two by sixty centimeter here two by sixty centimeter here two and now first go to the group then draw a rectangle here here two then empty here again create a window put color and here too then move it a little bit here and take a copy from this one here here so now draw another rectangle here draw a line here so now here is this line and draw a curve here here too so let me select move it by 20 centimeter and delete the 2D plan because we don't need it and extrude this face by 20 centimeter and now let me put a color for our object and a stone color for our ground then by using rectangle draw a rectangle by 30 centimeter comma 10 extrude it by 2 centimeter select all and take a copy from this one by L1 centimeter then extrude it up to here and select this one and this one and make them group and put a color take a copy up to here and type 13x then select all and my rotate tools take and copy press the control and take a copy let's move it here then select this one and take a copy from this up to here now my flip tools take a copy like this so guys as you can see our work is done i hope this tutorial was useful for you to support us please subscribe to our youtube channel if you haven't already so you don't miss our upcoming tutorial and don't forget to like comment and share the video with your friends